They've been called heroes, the first line of defense against the coronavirus. But healthcare workers have been particularly vulnerable to contracting the virus, and not for the reasons you might think. Health editor Dr. Maria Simbra reports. Even with personal protective equipment, a new study in the journal Lancet points to healthcare workers being at greater risk for coronavirus infection more than three times higher. It just shows that we need to be vigilant. I mean, we as healthcare workers need to you know, set the example. Um, I think we need to be very cautious as we're walking into patients' rooms. The researchers used the COVID symptom tracker app and studied the data of more than 2 million people in the U.S. and U.K. from late March to late April. This included 100,000 healthcare workers. Everybody from environmental services to dietary to clinicians to you know, phlebotomy test. More than 20% of healthcare workers reported at least one symptom, such as fatigue or loss of smell or taste, whereas only 14% of the general population did. And 2,700 healthcare workers per 100,000 were infected, compared to 240 per 100,000 in the general population. This was despite using gowns, gloves, and masks. This was a survey, right, on an app that patients self-reported and, and so forth. So I think we have to take that with a grain of salt. Dr. Singh does not believe these infections are because of patient care, but rather from community-acquired infection and lapses in PPE at work. You're going then into a break room, you're taking off your mask, you're trying to take a break, you're relaxing, and then, you know, it, it, it's potentially exposing somebody else. Also, the time period of the study was when PPE supplies were stretched thin, and that may have played a role in employee infection. Dr. Singh says not one of the 46 physicians in his group has become infected even with a high level of exposure. And they're seeing them almost on a daily basis in an ICU with aerosol generating, you know, type of procedure. They're not getting it because we're very stringent about, you know, appropriate PPE, we're appropriately cleaning it, we're appropriately donning it, um, and, and we're, we're very thankful for that. The researchers also looked at demographics and found Black, Asian, and other minorities five times as likely to be infected. With all of the data, you know, coming out that have been showing that, that uh, certain populations um, and ethnic groups have a higher risk, I think this falls in line with that. Dr. Singh says healthcare workers must set an example of wearing masks in public and being cautious where they go and their activities and interactions. I'm Dr. Maria Simbra, KDKA News.